What's up, everybody? It's your boy JD back again with another video. You guys know what time it is. It's time to hop back in that lookism greatness. So, we about to go ahead and get into it. Let's see what's in store for us today. But before we do, make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. Want to take support any further? Patreon link is in the description below. Also, join our top game membership and hit the notification bell so you're notified every time I upload a video or go live on the channel. So, let's go ahead and get into it, man. Also, just to let all of you know, um, I will be going on vacation um, this coming Saturday, um, the 27th. I will be on vacation, so there will not be a lookism um, video the following Sunday. However, I will be releasing all of the lookism videos um, that were redone. If you guys saw the community post, you already know. Um, so pretty much, um, in case you guys didn't see the community post, it's still up there. So go check out the community tab section if you haven't, because I post a lot of stuff there relating to the channel and everything else in its entirety um but i completed the lookism playlist i went back and redid all the videos that were lost um so now the lookism playlist will be completed from chapter one all the way to current um i will be releasing those videos while i'm on vacation um so you won't have a you know the chapter 489 lookism but you will have the other chapters of lookism um, with all of the missing arcs that's been in the playlist um, those will be released while I'm on vacation I should be back um, after that so you know before the next lookism chapter drops I should be back from vacation by then so you will have two lookism chapters you know that Sunday so just to give you guys a heads up so next Sunday won't be here be on vacation first vacation in 10 years y'all let me live um and the following sunday two lookisms two lookism chapters in that video so be on the lookout for that just want to give you guys a heads up for that shin ah, shim young charm pre-generation i've begun to join development with charles Troy. there is one thing that worries me sanji yuk who's still on the mountain if i leave him be he might end up posing a problem for me later on. My Yaksas would be able to take care of him without issue, but I have some other jobs lined up for them. That's why I summoned you capable gentlemen here today. Former member of Gabriel Kim's Fist Gang. Okay. Okay, okay, I get it already. Bogu Lee. So basically, you want us to take care of that Sonji Yuk guy. I love his hairstyle. I love his design. And will you be making it worthwhile while the three of us might still look young? Jaysu no. We really need to start preparing for retirement. To think we now had to resort to going after some first generation punk for money. Gaffron Kun's fist game standing is now at rock bottom it seems. If only boss Gaffron hadn't entered politics. I'm sure you'll find the conversation more than fair. But mark my words, it won't be as easy as you might expect. Sanji Yuk is a formidable fighter. He may end up, oh, he may very well end up besting all of you. Sanji Yuk, besting all of us, you say. How amusing. It's time to end this long standing grudge between us. We're in our prime. You're done for. Uh huh. We're gonna see. You know why my mom died? Tell me. I said, tell me. You better tell me right now. How did my mom die? Why did she die? Well, tell me now. Don't worry. I won't do anything to you yet. But once I become the shaman, well, you know what I'll tell you from then on. She having a goddamn panic attack. We ain't getting that answer. I'm sorry, I wasn't trying to scare you. I got a little too worked up in spite of myself. Uh, not in that way. Do you want me to get some water? Here you go. Please, please tell me. I spent my entire life hating my mom. I resented her all this time for dying and abandoning me. If there's anything you know about her, please tell me. I need to know. If you don't tell me then, I might keep hating my mom for the rest of my life. It was seven years ago. I was seven years old. Starting today, she'll be working here with us. She will attend to the shaman's every need. A new lady joined us at the shaman's house. It was a pretty lady. I'm originally from Seoul and now living in Chongliang. 
She was pretty, but she seemed sad somehow. The pretty lady was really diligent. Why are you working so hard? Because I made a promise with the shaman. For whatever reason, she did her best with the task she was given. Go to see the shaman. He's been looking for you. Apparently, she made some kind of promise involving her son with the shaman. The pretty lady worked hard for the sake of her son. Excuse me, young lady. I really liked her. To me, who had no mother. Looks like you're about my son's age. She became a mother figure. This is about to end tragic. A lollipop. But these are so rare. It's okay. Go ahead and eat it. I'll bring you another one later. If there's anything else you'd like to eat, just let me know. To me, she was like an angel. Here you are. Should I bite it or just let it dissolve in my mouth? Hurry over to the gym. The gym? Why? The shaman wants to see you. I see. I was curious. Why did the shaman keep asking for the pretty lady? Let it dissolve. I'll be going then. What could the shaman be wanting to talk to her about? Perhaps they were eating delicious food that they didn't want to share with the rest of us. And that day, I saw something I shouldn't have. Something bad. Sean was doing something pretty bad to the lady. Lady, are you okay? I saw everything. The shaman hit you, didn't he? Why did he do that? Was he mad at you? Did you do something to upset him? I could tell. No. We were in the gym, weren't we? Her eyes, and she said those words. The shaman and I were just practicing judo, that's all. They were eyes of a liar. Well, what are you waiting for? Strip. What is he doing? Please stop. I don't want to do this anymore. Is that right? Find it. Let's stop. Sure, your son would be on the be the one who suffers the consequences. I told you that I sent you back to Seoul if you worked hard, yet you're giving up already. You'll never be able to return to Seoul at this rate. I'm assuming he was he was clapping. He was um he was clapping cheeks. That's what I'm assuming. Um but I could be wrong because you say he was hitting her, but I don't know. I don't know. But that that's what I'm assuming because he was looking at her with like, boy, she kind of bad, boy. And Benjamin's mom is is kind of bad. So that's what I'm assuming. Y'all let me know if I'm if I'm right in that assumption, unless they're about to give it to me right now. Once I kick you out of this house, how do you plan to make any money? Do you think you'll be able to keep your son fed and clothed in my Charlie game? Besides, who knows? Am I just end up using your son as a sacrifice? Why are you doing this? What have I ever done to deserve this? What have either my son or I done to deserve this? We've done nothing wrong. Who is this? Is this him? You fucking bitch. What have you done wrong? What have you done wrong, you ask? You think you're the victim here, don't you? You think I'm the villain? Uh, yeah. You don't even know who the real victim is. Oh, snap. If you think your life is so tough, just die. Die right here and now. You can't even do that, can you? Who knows? If you die, I might just be moved enough to not use your son as a sacrifice. But you're too much of a coward to do that. And you don't even know which one of us really wants to die here. What have you done wrong, you ask? Do you really want to know? I'll tell you. Is she dead? That was the last time I ever saw that pretty lady. I don't know what the two of them talked about. But one thing's for sure. Your mom. That pretty lady died because of Sim Young Chong. That's it's rough. It's rough in these streets, man. It is rough in these streets. Poor Vin Jin, though. That man spent all his life hating his mom. Because he like my mom killed herself for me. Well, killed herself for her. And left me here. When all the while. She was murdered. And then they made it look like a suicide. (sighs) 
But they ain't gonna go and whoop their ass, boy. He gonna go and whoop all of their ass. Time to change shifts. Already? I don't know why we need to keep Swatch in a sleepy little town like this. They've apparently had intruders in the past. Anyway, have a good shift. Thanks. Good night. I'm already getting sleepy. I don't know how I'm gonna last at the end of my shift. Oh, Virginia said, you ain't gonna last at the end of your shift. I can guarantee that you ain't lasting to the end of your shift. Stop. That's enough of that. At this rate, I'm gonna vomit. Pathetic. Are, oh, you're giving up already. I thought you wanted to be Vin-Jin. This is pissing me off. I can't help but feel discouraged. How the heck is Vin so strong? He started learning Serum and Kudo way later than the rest of us, yet we can't hold a candle to his fighting prowess. The only one who can beat him is Mary. That's not true. Vin's never come at me in earnest. He's only ever fought me using Judo techniques. I'm just better at Judo than he is, that's all. His potential is on a different level. His potential. Benjamin's starter point is completely different from yours. He's simply been unaware of that fact all this time. The reason why Benjamin is that strong is simple. Because just as that man awakened the potential within me, I awakened the potential within him. I knew Vin was going to whoop their ass, man. It wasn't no way you were just going to sit there and let that slide. Samuel Chong is inside, isn't he? Shut up. Vin about to beat all of them down. Vin's starting point is different. What's that supposed to mean? Is the blood running through its veins different from ours? Whose blood is it exactly? A member of the pre-generation. A legendary figure in Korean. Okay, so this is Vin Jin's dad. A lifelong wanderer with no affiliation. Who lived as a wild man for all of his days. The founder of Mujin Jin style. I thought that was his. Oh. Whose fighting prowess was said to be on par with that of Gabriel Kim. That's right. The Vin Jin you know. Where the fuck is Semyon Chong? Is that of the. Mujin Jin. Is the son of that man. Mujin Jin. Oh shit. So, Vin's father was on. Um, the pre generation is where one day we're going to get like a whole pre generation arc where it's just going to be nothing but the pre generation. I'm looking forward to that because we, we need it, bro. Everybody is from the pre generation. That's where this whole fucking series started. It's the pre generation with Gabriel Kim and everything that happened when he was in his younger days. That's how all this fucking shit started, and we're introducing him. Now, Vin Jin's father, who was in the pre-generation, Mu Jin Jin, was on par with Gabrion Kim. Don't know who's, who was stronger. Don't know who was stronger between the two. It just said he was on par with him. Maybe they was tied. Maybe they was equally, but it was still so, so many other things. We got to crazy craziness damn Ben gonna whoop their ass though Ben gonna beat them down but that's it for today's video I hope you guys enjoy you did make sure to drop a like sub to the channel let me know what you guys think about everything that happened in the comment section below I'll see you guys wanna keep up with me Twitch Twitter Discord links all of that is in the description as well and I will catch you guys next time peace